1MDB was created by the Malaysian government to promote economic development with the ultimate goal of improving the well-being of the Malaysian people. But unfortunately, sadly, tragically, a number of corrupt 1MDB officials treated this public trust as a personal bank account. Additionally, the misappropriation of funds were used to acquire nearly $100 million in real estate including high-end real estate in New York and Los Angeles, artworks by Vincent van Gogh, including a $35 million work by Claude Monet. But these works of arts were not put in museums in Malaysia for the benefit of the population. Rather, they were obtained to further enhance the luxury and lavish lifestyles of those stealing money from one MDV. They used the money to pay gambling debts at Las Vegas casinos. They rented luxury yachts. They hired an interior decorator in London. Among the purchases was a Bombardier jet with a purchase price of about $35 million. Um, and also used the money to finance the award-winning 2013 film, The Wolf of Wall Street. Neither 1MDB or the Malaysian people ever saw a penny of profit from that film. Instead, it is alleged that money was siphoned from this fund for personal investment, whose beneficial owner was a close relative of a senior 1MDB official. Not for the good of the Malaysian people, and not for the achievement of their goals. The Malaysian people were defrauded on an enormous scale. This is the largest kleptocracy seizure in U.S. history.